It is a beautiful Saturday afternoon in Statesboro, Georgia, as we welcome you to J.I. Clement Stadium for the Sunbelt Conference Baseball Tournament Semifinals. Our first matchup today pitches, pits the number three seed South Alabama Jaguars against the number seven seed Arkansas State Red Wolves. They'll need a two out RBI from him right here to bring home Colton Thomas. And that ball is hit in the air, deep center field. Rucker going back and over his head. Colton Thomas is going to score, and the Jags have taken a 1-0 lead on the big double by Travis Swaggerty. Part of that power we were talking about for Swaggerty. 2-2 pitch to Davis, and that ball is hit to center field, and it's going to be, is it caught? No, it was trapped in center field by Rucker, and Swaggerty is going to come home and score, and it's 2-0. So many opportunities here in the first three innings, and you have only two runs on the board. The ball is hit to Hardy, and Hawkins is tagging. Here comes the throw right down the line, and sliding without a throw to the plate is Hawkins, a sack fly RBI for Rucker, and Arkansas State has cut South Alabama's lead in half, 2-1. to one. And that's how you kind of put it together, and that's exactly what Arkansas State has done through the first couple days of this tournament. You get Here's the 1-0 to Perkins. That ball is socked into right field for a base hit. Here comes LeBounty around third base. Here comes the throw to the plate, and LeBounty is safe. And South Alabama has their third run of the ball game as they finally break through with a big RBI single by Carter Perkins. Ball is driven towards the gap in left center field, and it's going to one-hop the wall. Hawkins touches third. He gets waved home by Ratho. Here comes the throw to the plate. Collision at the plate. And Hawkins is safe. And it's three to two. And just like the last play where he recognized it coming off the end of the bat and he backed up. Loft hits this one towards the gap in right field and... Seldom Ridge cannot come up with it. LeBounty will score from second, and the Jaguars have that insurance run that they were looking for. Tim Seldom Ridge had just been put into the game this inning to play right field, could not run down that ball off the bat of Luft in the gap. Not because he didn't give it a great effort, too, because he did everything he could. He covered a lot of ground. Down to their final strike. Peacock to the plate, ground ball, hit to LeBounty. He bobbles it, picks it up, throws, and got him. And South Alabama, for the second time in three years, will play for the Sun Belt Tournament Championship. A 4-2 victory over Arkansas State to eliminate the number seven seed. And now the Jaguars await the winner of our...